pepper tasting video. Yara City Forest Garden. First ever pepper tasting starting with Pippin's Golden Honey Pepper. We have our palate cleansers over here. Cucumber from the garden. Is this spicy? I think it's moderately spicy. We'll find out. Oh, it smells spicy. I'll take spicy. a little piece. You want a little piece? Oh yeah, I'm not going to eat that whole thing. I'm just going to take a small bite of it. It's sweet at first. A very sweet, very, very sweet. bell pepper. I can see why it's called honey, golden honey. Mm -hmm. I don't taste any spice. Also, the tip is the least spicy part. It tastes like a little pineapple. It is a... Very sweet. I, I feel the honey flavor for sure. It's very sweet. Like a rounded out sweetness, a wholesome sweetness. It's citrusy. Mm -hmm. Let's taste it. We need to taste a little part that's not actually eat the seeds, but that's closer to the seeds to see if there's more heat up here. I think this is one of the most edible sweet peppers I've ever had. It's a hot pepper. It, is it? Or maybe not. I don't think it's hot. doesn't taste hot you're right it's not hot it's sweet mm -hmm. and it's very sweet and um tangy and piney and it's very fruity and it's awesome i put one of those in the black beans actually that are on the stove so i don't know that. if i'm ready this pepper is called lucifer's dream it's a type of red habanero yep this thing shape very red you don't have to cut a big piece Whoa, you got the one, baby. This smells super hot. fruity. Mm -hmm. It definitely smells hot. It's a very expansive smell. You breathe it in, and it just fills up your nostrils. Yeah, it's with, very um, good. The foreshadowing of heat and fruitiness. Huge foreshadowing of heat. It was super fruity. Divine. Oh my god. There's tiny bits here. Let me try this little tiny bit. Lucifer's dream. Super hot immediately. Other wow. ones build the spice and this one is heat forward. Yeah. This is very heat forward. Kill the mustard after it. What is like that enjoyable spice? Like your tongue is not burning. It's like a tingle. It gives you that your tongue that tingly sensation instead yeah. of like a burn at the back of your throat. So true. And then instead of any burn building up, it's more like the flavor is allowed to out. Stimulate your tongue. Mm -hmm. Immediately you smell it, you start salivating it. You start thinking, wow, this is this is very good. It's even though I can smell the spice, I also want to taste it. Yeah. It has like a very slight bit of that numbing heat at first, but it goes away. It goes away. And it's very like I don't have to eat a piece of cucumber, even though it's hot. Mm -hmm. It's the, the sensation of hot is different. Yeah, it's pleasant. Alright, our next pepper tasting is the Ethiopian Burberry pepper. Here's one that's nice and ripe. It's got this beautiful brown color. It looks almost purple in the video, but it's very warm brown, dark yep. warm brown. And this is a hot pepper. So it's gonna be a hot pepper. Supposed to. Wow. <laughs> it's not all right. Oh yeah. It, it clears out your sinuses definitely a cleanser it smells very smoky earthy mm -hmm. you herbal no, herbal yeah very wow. spicy very spicy clarifying like a clarifying it is also fruity and the heat comes at the back end like now is when i'm feeling the intense heat so it's a build up like a, a habanero. Mm -hmm. I think it's smoky, it's smooth, it's It has nice. this like spicy heat that's very unique to me. Yeah, it is very unique. Um, it's not as fruity as a lot of the peppers that I go for. I really love like scotch bonnet fruitiness and lively. But this is like... Very different flavor. Very different, very chocolatey. Yeah, herbal like soil it just tastes like the minerals in the soil mineral in the soil it does 
It does. It's very good. It's nice, but it's not too hot to eat a small piece of broth. Yeah. It's, it's very not. enjoyable. It's time for the showdown. The real showdown. Yeah. We have the sweet bonnet right here. Much more smaller than the um the scotch bonnet. But very similar growth habit. Here's the scotchy. Which is also you say it's also known as country pepper. Yeah. It's a specific type of scotch bonnet maybe. Yeah. Very pretty. You're very pretty. It's not like the other scotch bunnies that I see around. It's very unique to Jamaica. Which one do you All right, next up, we got the scotchy. The honorable scotch bonnet pepper. The original Prime Minister of Jamaica. Is he? Yeah, man, let us cut into this dime piece. This is too beautiful. Super fruity, like even the sweet part of the flavor palette, it has more, it gives my nose more stimulation. Than it's giving bonnet. peach, pineapples, nectar, mango, of the gods. spicy, just all around beautiful scent. Like it smells like when food are cooked at Jamaica. You scared of that big piece? I'm not getting it all. I'm not scared. Scotch bonnet. Hmm. It's not spicy at all. I was trying to bottom of the peppers, but that's the least spicy part. That's true. Or scotchy. It's super flavorful. Okay. That's superb. I'm getting to the heat now. Yeah. Yeah. Super fruity. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Getting to the heat now. This one's not spicy at all. And that's happening with, with scotch bonnet sometimes. Sometimes it comes spicier than. And other other times, I think that's how they got the sweet bonnet in the first place. I think that's how they got the sweet bonnet in the first place. Well, this one's not too spicy, but we have tried other ones. That's spicy, and um, the closer you get to the seed, yeah, I'm is willing the to more try another piece for accuracy's sake. Yeah. Abby's gonna back. take one for the team. A fraction. Okay. No man, you just bite it up. Oh yeah, the heat is definitely there. It's nice, it's like, um, I mean, it hits you in the back of your throat and the front of your, t the tip of your tongue at the same time and it's just sort of tingling and spreading. Yes. Um, but it takes the sweetness of the flavor with you as it tingles and spreads. It's not just the heat that's spreading it across the palate. That this is pepper true. is definitely hot. I it's think not it's, unbearable, but it's nice. It's not unbearable. Um, it is very fragrant. I think this would make a nice cocktail. Mm. Yeah, Ooh, maybe man. in like a see I would say a margarita margarita spicy whatever. margarita but tequila is not your friend alright time for the big showdown mighty showdown between sweet bonnet versus scotch bonnet so sweet bonnet is like the sweeter version of scotch bonnet I'm gonna pull one out to compare side by side the sweet bonnet is much more compact and it's said to have all the flavor of a scotch bonnet without the heat. Let's see. Let's, let's try see. the sweet bonnet first. Sweet bonnet. Let's try the riper one. All right. It ripens red like the what's its face? Lucifer's dream. Mm -hmm. You want to try a piece? Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. You want me to cut these more? Yeah? No. I know it's um sweet, so I'm not nervous. It almost like fakes you out on the heat where it's it like, does. you know, you get that scent that heat is coming. The scent that heat is coming. And there's a little tingle on your tongue, but I took a way bigger bite of this than any of the other things that we've, hot peppers that we've tried. And it's a mild. It is very mild, but it, yeah, as you say, it does give you a huge fake out because you're like, hmm, this may be spicy, but it's not at all spicy. Mm -mm. It's it very nice. pleasant. And um, it's very aromatic, much like scotch bonnet. Although I don't think it's quite as fruity and aromatic as the scotchy. We'll see. We'll see. In my recollection. You like it? Mm -hmm. Good. First up, we're going to taste the rainforest chili. 
it was one of the earliest to produce for us this year and um, it hasn't slowed down ever since even with the changing temperatures and the increased rainfall it has been such a resilient plant should we taste the part from the middle because sometimes the tip is not fully indicative of how Abby wants it spicy. I just want to true to the flavor. True to the flavor. Why not use this whole thing? I can smell it. It smells divine. Yeah. Slightly citrusy. Slightly citrusy. And maybe also a little carrot too. Like a, a... Yeah. You're right. You want to taste? Mm, oh, fruity. Real fruity and juicy right off the bat. Yeah, mm -hmm. real tropical vibes, like fresh. You could easily use this mm -hmm. as a sweet, like a slightly hot sweet pepper. Wouldn't you say? That's how sweet it is to me. This doesn't even taste spicy. Oh, it doesn't taste spicy. But as you go closer to the scene, it tastes the spice. It doesn't taste spicy to me. Are we sure this is a chili? No, uh, that's the, a thing with peppers. When they get a lot of rainfall, they're not as spicy. This tastes like a straight up bell pepper. It's you want to eat it? Spicy. See, now it tastes like a, a bell pepper. Eat it. Eat it. It's sweet? It's nice, yeah. It's delicious. Will you grow it again? Mm hmm. It's but not it spicy like the um, packages say, but we did try some earlier on in the season and they were spicy. I guess I double check on this. Here, Moving on from the rainforest thing. chili that Abby decimated, mm -hmm. it's not spicy. Um, we tried er some earlier in the season and they were spicy, but who knows? Sometimes the packages misinform. Next. Mm -hmm. We're going to try the fatale oh, peppers. We know this one's gonna be hot. Who knows? It's such a pretty pepper. Um, really golden. Produces a lot, would you say? Mm -hmm. But uh, I would say, uh, oh, Jesus wept. This oh one. Oh my hot. gosh, this one is so hot. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah, man. It's so, a little bit smoky and it just fills up your nose. Oh, you gotta give me a smaller piece than that. Like a fraction of <laughs> no, that. but because you like spice, I'm not gonna eat that whole thing. Big up yourself, spice queen of the dance hall. Yeah, but can't manage it. Fatale, let's try. Whoa, oh, super hot! It's super hot. Oh my gosh, whoa, but flavorful. Yeah, it like burns from the moment it touches your tongue, and it's just like your my tongue feels like a pepper corn. It tastes like a little spearmint. This tastes like a juicy fruit mixed with a, like a wintergreen spearmint. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I totally taste Together like and it's spicy. Mm -hmm. That's what it tastes like. As it it spreads flavor. all over your mouth. It spreads all over like your gums. Like my mouth is on fire right now and I love spicy food, but I'm definitely on fire right now. Yeah, Fatale, will it be in the garden next year? Oh yeah. This is definitely. Nice. Is your mouth on fire or is it just me? My mouth is really on fire, baby. <laughs> Can I tell you? No, it, for me, it goes. I feel like it's on my teeth, my gums, I feel like it's all over me. Wow. It's nice. But it's very hot. It's very hot. And we haven't done a blooper for a pepper. Oh, this one took me down. <laughs> this one took you out? Yeah, second pepper of the day. The fatality mm. took out Abby. It's so it's nice. so, as you said, invigorating. Mm -hmm. It does give you, it uplifts your mood. Yeah, because it definitely changed the pace of our day. Mm -hmm. uh, it has you knocked out, but... Spicy peppers from a blood flow. Blood flow is so it's good for you, Anna. Next up, the jigsaw pepper. Jigsaw pepper. Whoa. Puzzle pieces falling everywhere. As per usual, these tiny pockets of joy, they look like... Yeah, there are all these kind of like different shapes that have, um, I can see how you get jigsaw pieces, you know, puzzle piece from that. It's abstract. Definitely. 
Let's try it. Let's taste it. Which one do you want to try? Pick up one. A nice red one. Oh, just we're just both going straight for it. Yeah. We're oh, just... you got to get a riper one than that. That looks good to me. Cheers. Cheers. Bombo clarity pat. Why? Definitely packs a punch. Damn, I took too much of a bite. I would never be in the whole thing. I'm so sorry. Wow. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. I'm so sorry. You're brave. <laughs> Impressive. This is very spicy. And a tiny little package. Small pepper. Not a lot of flavor. No, on my it's end. very one dimensional. Like w hot water is what yeah. it tastes like to me. But not like tea. No. <laughs> in a different way. Spicy water. Spicy water. So this is no good. fruity, <laughs> really. Wow. I taste like almost a slight like vinegary, like I could see this going yeah. in a plain hot sauce, a very straightforward hot sauce. Yeah, I think um, pairing it with the scotchy or the fatale would, would make a really beautiful hot sauce that stays spicy because it's still burning all of my mouth. Mm -hmm. uh, will you be growing this next year? The plant is the productive. plant's really beautiful. Um, it's variegated leaves. They're like white and purple and green. Super productive. I definitely would grow for the aesthetic value, but this is definitely not my favorite pepper to eat. Okay. <coughs> um, Cut. <laughs> so can you tell us what happened? I ate the fucking jigsaw pepper, man. How much of it? Like half of a tiny pepper. Half. It looks like almost the whole thing to me. Just eat half. It's not you alone who can't handle the heat. One of these took him down. These tiny little peppers. How's that ice Good cream? Good thing looking? I have ice cream. Good thing. <laughs>